In this video, we're going to look at photosynthesis. Photosynthesis is a reaction that occurs in a part of the cells called the chloroplasts. And it occurs there because of the presence of an enzyme called chlorophyll. And chlorophyll is what gives plants their green pigment. And the reason photosynthesis occurs is so that autotrophic organisms, so organisms that produce their own energy, uh, can harness energy from the sun and therefore make glucose, so make food for themselves. Photosynthesis is something that is covered at all levels of science. So by now you should know that the basic reaction for photosynthesis is that we have carbon dioxide absorbed by the leaves, uh, water that's absorbed from the roots in the presence of light energy and the enzyme chlorophyll in the chloroplasts produces oxygen as a byproduct which is let out of the leaves as well as the glucose which stays in the plant and the plant uses it around its body for growth and whatnot. But that is a huge simplification on what the actual equation or the actual processes that are happening are. Again, like respiration, this is a multi-step process with lots of reactions and side reactions. And again, we don't need to actually memorize all of that, but we do need to understand that when we say carbon dioxide plus water in the presence of chlorophyll and light becomes sugar and oxygen, that that is a vast simplification. Uh, it doesn't begin to cover all the processes that are involved in this reaction. And just a little bit of chemistry here. When we write equations, in science, and particularly in chemistry, this is a chemical equation, uh, because light and chlorophyll are the catalysts, so it has the reaction has to occur in the presence of them, however they're not used up, so catalyst enzymes, uh, they aren't written in the reactants or the products, but are written over the top and the bottom of the actual arrow.